it's welded it's together as you saw at the beginning of the video i tacked it all together and then put some welds on it simple as that now all i've got to do is let it cool down because it's rather hot once it's cooled down i'll give it a good clean over i'll get rid of as much spatter as i can uh, i'll have a look at removing some welds but i'm not really too bothered because it's underneath the low coat you're not going to see it So these little delights that you've just seen me quickly machine are um, spring retainers. 
all happens is we put the springs on which we may be changing these once we've got an, an idea of the weight on the back end these might get changed to more appropriate length ones and then it slides on over the spring like so and I'm just going to use a normal nut for now and voila perfect as you can see the little retaining washer sits inside keeping it so it'll keep the spring in position so hopefully once we get a one piece spring in there possibly we'll see it uh, will keep that top one in, in, in its central position so I'll get the rest of them on uh, and then we'll see where we're at there we go you won't even see them really but it's just nice to know that they'll be kept central really we need one on that plate but I don't think it'll matter it's got some weight now so there's no chance of it uh, bouncing off the track it shouldn't do with all the weight on the top so we'll get it in position and then figure out what length we need for some for this bar here so it wants to be somewhere around there which is slightly further back off the central line of here but it doesn't matter that's just in case we need to come right out we need to make sure that the rollers hit the plate which they do quite nicely really they could have done with being further forward but as we're making it up as we go along everything's superb so we'll measure now from the inside here to the central spigot about 372 mil to the centre so we need to make a bar now that we can press fit that bearing on into so the centre of there to the front of there where it's going to be welded on is 372 mil so that's it for this video and if you like what you see on the channel and you haven't done already if you wouldn't mind clicking the subscribe button and the notification bell and you'll be notified when we next release a video and don't forget to click the like button and that will help this video share around to like-minded people like yourself who has exceedingly good taste if you'd like to see more of similar content from me then if you click here then you could enjoy that one too stay safe laters another good choice